Okay, hello guys. So this is the Realme C17, and in this video, I will show you how to root this one using custom recovery and also mages all the files and step i will provide in my blog you can check the link in the description box okay so if there's any update I will provide also in my blog and if you have any question you can always ask on the comment section okay so stay tuned and check it out Okay, hello guys, Assalamualaikum, we'll meet again with Ombop. This time we have a uh, Realme Pawn and I'll show you how to root this pawn. Okay, this is the Realme C17. Okay, let's check this system using the Realme UI version, UI version 2 on Android 11. Okay, yeah. let's check the version. It's using the build number C16. Okay, so this is the latest version when I'm making this video. And make sure that you have already unlocked your pawn because it's needed before you before you want to root your pawn. Okay, so to check the root order status, you can go to the build number right here hit five times go back back again additional settings go to the developer options and here you go you can see my OM unlock has been unlocked okay as uh the pawn has been unlocked go okay and now let's check the status maybe some of you guys want to know if the pawn has rooted or not you can see right here it's not been rooted you can also check by the app this detector it can detect mages exposed and other stuff okay nice so if you want to know how to uh, do unlock put order on realme pawn you can check my other video i'll put a link in the description box Okay, now for the next step, let's turn off the pawn and let's put into the fast boot mode. Okay, as usual, fast boot mode can be accessed by pressing volume down and the power button at the same time. Okay, when you see the Realme logo, just press the two button and you're good to go. Okay, I'll plug USB cable. and let's switch the screen okay so this is all the file that we did it and this is the step okay all the file and step i'll provide in my blog you can check the link in the description box okay now let's open powershell or cmd and let's tap some command okay the first thing we want to do is flash the modify v meta to disable it okay just type this command just click and, and click and drag the file uh, hit enter then let's flash the recovery it's quite straightforward there is nothing fancy about the command <laughs> okay and we'll have this file just extract the file then click and drag the file right here then you can boot into the custom recovery Okay, so it it will boot it, and it takes a couple of seconds for it. Okay, nice. Now we are already booted. Let's switch the screen again, and here we go now we can see that we are in the custom recovery okay there, there are several things that i want to show you that the custom recovery is still in beta stage so there is 
some feature that still doesn't work uh, I'll show you the first thing we still cannot pick up the UFS okay the modem and other stuff so you can pick up modem Wi-Fi and other stuff using a command line uh, I will put the will make a video about it and you can check the link okay then it's still encrypted <coughs> so you have to format the data to to uncrypt or decrypt the file okay. and still we cannot flash custom recovery on it all you can do is just flash magis using the custom recovery <laughs> okay and what else uh <clears throat> yeah you still cannot read the internal uh, the micro sd even though i have a micro sd so we're going to flash using the adb site load okay so go to the advanced right here adb site load and swipe it okay that's with this that suits the screen and from here you can type adb spice space side load and let's find the magis okay feel free to use magis version that you like for this time i'm going to use the delta canary okay just click and drag the file and it will start the process okay it just takes several seconds after it finish we can boot into the system and check if the pawn has been rooted or not okay <clears throat> uh, like I said before I, I will not cover how to pick up email and Wi-Fi but I will make uh, another video on it okay so it's finished uh, just hit reboot system and I'll skip this one we'll continue after it boots into the home screen and now we are in the home screen let's check if the magis has been installed or not okay it's, it's been installed but still it's not it's not perfect you can open the magis and upgrade to full version okay uh it will download the apk but you can also install the apk separately if you want to okay hit, inst hit install and where is it <laughs> okay so now it has been installed let's open it and use it for the first time it will ask to reboot the pawn okay uh okay if if the device doesn't ask for reboot you can always reboot the pawn manually okay i usually enable the JGS JGS loader JGS hide and enforce tools okay and then put loop protection Okay, and let's reboot the pawn just to make sure that it's working properly. Okay, and now we are in the home screen again. Okay, let's open the magis, and here we go. Now it has been successfully installed. Let's check using the root checker and root beer. Okay, let's hit check. And okay, it's not rooted because we're using this to enforce list. Okay, this is the settings. Where is it? Uh, configure to list is the backward of the menu side. So if you want to get root access, you have to ch checklist the apps. Okay, it is the reverse of the official images ok 
okay for example if i want to root build get access root checker root explorer and other stuff i must check the apps and let's open it again okay let's hit check and brand it okay done your device has been root and let's check the root beer <clears throat> it also read so if you want if you want the apps doesn't read the root don't check the apps okay that's all guys i hope it helps you see you in the next video and i hope you like my video if you find it very useful please give it a thumb and i also have lots of video about routing custom rom and lots of fun okay especially xiaomi samsung realme asus and other stuff okay uh you can find in my video maybe some of the video will be useful for you okay guys if you subscribe it will make me excited to make a new video and that's all stay self stay safe stay health and wassalamualaikum